Did you that. see that thing where Mike Tyson was actively trying to arrange mm. a fight with a gorilla? Yeah. 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 Is that true? Yeah. Yeah. Oh my God, dude. He, he was on died. a lot of cocaine. Yeah. That um, he would have died. Can I say this? He would have put up a little of a fight. Oh, no, he would have been would've... beaten to death by no. his own detached arm. I, I've like animals are always taken aback by confidence. Yeah, you, well, you've seen it, right? Like you've yeah. seen like 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 how like those little animals would be like confident as fuck. Like a little dog will like run off a big dog at first for sure. Like the little dog comes out and is like hard as fuck. The big dog yeah. is like, whoa, I need to evaluate this before I go any further. <laughs> Let me size you up, little man. God damn, you're aggressive. Like like they don't know yeah. what to do. Gorilla would have the same thing, I think. I think Mike Tyson comes in there and he's just fucking. I, you know, he'd give him one of these, one of those King Kong chest <laughs> things, and, and the gorilla be like, "The fuck," and they'd be like, "Mike, don't make eye contact," and he'd be like, "Bitch, <laughs> <laughs> come on," and he fucking he'd be he, he'd get a few in, and then I think the gorilla might might maul him. I, but I, I think, think what I, would happen is he would get like two of the heaviest punches in ever. Yeah. Before the gorilla fully internalized, like, are we fighting? What's it doing? Is it petting at me? Oh, oh, he's trying to fuck me up. And then the gorilla would use his gorilla arms and Time tear out. off his genitals and his feet and his hands. I'm going I'm, I'm to make a wild statement here. Mike Tyson with brass knuckles beats a silverback gorilla. That's outrageously stupid. Mike Tyson with brass knuckles kills a that silverback gorilla. That is bar gorilla. none the dumbest thing you've ever said. I think he would break no. his hands still. No, they wrap him. We're going to wrap him. We're going to wrap okay. him. We've got custom made Mike Tyson. I don't think gloves. you can. I, I just don't think you could. Like, Mike Tyson is somebody I would never want to get hit by, but I don't think you could knock out a gorilla. Um, I mean, if we're talking like just strength alone, the, the amount of strength in that, in the gorilla package, like uh, you could put Andre the Giant, you know, fucking, yeah. what was he, seven foot five, 500 pounds legit. Like, you could put him in there and the gorilla still overpowers. People who have yeah. fought the gorillas and chimps and stuff all say that. Like I've heard that again. There, there's a guy. He's an MMA fighter, badass. He's not UFC level, but let's just agree that if the guy fights mm -hmm. MMA for money, he's badass. Yeah. And uh, he fights a baby chimp, a baby chimp, and he it barely gets out of there. It certainly you wouldn't call it a win. He's like, you know, like like I hit it on the head. I was afraid I was gonna hurt it. Unbeknownst to me. You can't hurt it. <laughs> you know, he's he held it by the arms. This is a baby chimp, right? This guy's yeah. like two hundred pounds against thirty. I, I don't even know. And uh, um, he's like, I, I told him, and he's he's not like people. He's like wood. He's like a wooden animal. And it just apparently they're just solid and just strong, dense. Yeah. dense, and and able to take a headshot. He was hitting it with like a club. Oh. Or something. Do you know this skulls. video? No, but I'm, I'm, I'm like, like what I know, my, my, my hours and hours of show. being stoned and watching David Attenborough <laughs> are coming in here. Their skulls are tremendously thicker than ours. And it mm -hmm. matters. Like we, we think of our skull as this thing that's like, oh yeah, that's a helmet. All right. So it, basically it keeps our brains from spilling out. Right. Like that's mm -hmm. all our, our skulls are good for. Theirs aren't like that. Theirs are still good at defending them from everything and anything. That makes sense. I punched a cow in the head one time. Don't ask why. Like, like you just, <laughs> And the, the and cow was probably looking at you funny. I mean, I hit it like in the top, like between the eyes hard. It hurt my <clears> hand <throat> so much. And, and there, when I say there is no given a cow skull, I mean, it. it felt like hitting a wall feels less solid than hitting a cow in the head. Like, like yeah. you can dent, you can put a little dent in sheetrock. It'll wobble a little bit. Like even wood. Yeah. That big this, flat part on the top of their head. It's just, yeah. It's like the it's corner of a retaining wall. Is it crazy yeah. how some things are harder than hard? Like for to me, ice, ice. is harder than concrete. Somehow. Ice is harder than yeah. concrete. Our I, ice is definitely harder. Doesn't... Being cold doesn't help. That's mm. true. Yeah, mm. everything yeah. feels harder to fall on when you're cold. You know what the I hardest look... thing known to man is your your icy driveway. Because <laughs> <laughs> it's yeah. both. It's I was icy like diamonds. Concrete. Nah, he's right. <laughs> yeah, it's icy concrete. If you've ever walked down a steep driveway trying to like take the garbage out. And be like, okay, it's just that bullshit ice. That's like ice that that's like skidding around on top. And then you hit that solid piece at the bottom, that black ice, and your your heels go out, and your ass just hits the fuck. Oh.